Hello everyone, welcome to Gandhi's YouTube channel. Today, we'll show you how to restore a domain name. So, what's a domain restoration? And what are the differences between domain restoration, domain buyback, and a secondhand domain? Before we answer that, let's take a look at this life cycle of a domain chart. After registration of a domain name, the life cycle of a domain begins. A newly registered domain name can be refunded within five days, but not all domain names are refundable. Depending on the domain purchased, there may be a different expiration date. For the most common domain endings within 45 days of the expiration date, you can simply renew your domain name to get it back. However, once 45 days have passed, the domain name will enter the redemption grace period. In this period, if you want to restore a domain name, you'll need to pay the restoration price. If you don't restore the domain name after the redemption period, the domain name will enter the pending delete period. Then after deletion, the domain name will go back to no status and anyone can register it. Once a domain name has been in the auto renew grace period for 45 days, it becomes restorable. The redemption price is normally about 10 times that of a renewal. So please don't forget to renew your domain name. Otherwise, you may have to pay more when it enters the redemption period. Domain buyback and secondhand domain, under normal circumstances, often refer to buying back a domain name from a third party who bought it when it was released. That's the main way domain buyback is different from domain restoration. Again, remember, the price you pay will likely be much higher to get your domain back, so please remember to renew your domain name. So, how do you restore a domain name once it's entered the redemption period? First, click Domain on the left after logging into your account. If your domain name is in the redemption period, it will appear at the top of the page in the Restorable column. Choose the domain name you want to restore, then click the icon on the right side of the domain and add it to your cart. You can then proceed to check out and restore your domain name. Now you know how to restore your domain name, and you also know the importance of a domain name's life cycle, as well as the redemption period. We also strongly suggest that you enable the automatic renewal option on your domain names to avoid this type of situation from happening. We'll cover that in a future tutorial. Thanks for watching today's tutorial, and don't forget to subscribe to Gandhi's YouTube channel for more videos like this one.